This is our look ahead to Thursday's key political and financial events. The EU summit gets going in Brussels, where leaders will try to hammer out the bloc's long-term budget for 2014 to 2020. Talks in November ended without a deal on the planned expenditure, worth nearly €1 trillion. Euros. Dominic Johnson from Somerset Capital Management says it's likely we'll see progress, but an impasse could come with a hefty price tag. If national governments and if, uh, veto or if there cannot be unanimity with the budget deal, then you go um, back to default to the budget, which is the highest level um, of spending that we had in 2013. So that would actually result in quite a substantial increase in the EU budget. We're also back on Central Bank Watch. Both the ECB and Bank of England hold policy meetings, neither seen moving on benchmark interest rates or stimulus measures. But traders on the lookout for any comments from ECB President Mario Draghi on the euro. Here in the UK, the attention will centre on incoming BOE Chief Mark Carney as he testifies to a parliamentary committee at 9.45 GMT. He's seen as a new broom who'll look at alternative policy options and has already suggested targeting nominal economic growth rather than inflation. Plenty of data from the UK on Thursday too. Industrial and manufacturing output figures expected to show gains in December from the previous month. This after UK construction PMI in January saw a modest expansion. In Germany, December industrial output data for the month of December is expected to stagnate. While data in France may show the country's trade deficit continued to narrow in December. In the debt market, Spain auctions paper due in 2015, 2018 and 2029, plus France sells up to €8 billion Euros of notes. On the earnings front, the French drug maker Sanofi expected to confirm February the 7th that profits declined between 12 and 15 per cent last year as the company bore the brunt of generic competition for its former top selling products. We'll also have earnings from Daimler. Analysts expect the German automaker to say fourth quarter operating profit fell nearly 24 per cent. And we'll speak to the company's chief executive, Dieter Zetscher, following the news conference. You can catch that live just before 11 GMT or on demand on Reuters.com. Fourth quarter earnings also due from Credit Suisse, ArcelorMittal and Vodafone. Well, that's our look ahead to Thursday. And don't forget, we'll be streaming incoming Bank of England Governor Mark Carney's testimony live on Insider and Reuters.com. That's at 9.45 GMT. I'm Nigel Stevenson. This is Reuters.